Justin Fricky, I'm the forage and cover crop specialist with Millborn Seeds. You know, when it comes to taking care of your huge investment on your farm, your land, we know that we've got to do a better job on it, and, and we're starting to utilize better practices in terms of precision agriculture with our fertilizer requirements and, and uh, things like cover crops that we're out here looking at today. Uh, and, and you know what we're doing? We're taking great strides in, in making sure that we really, um, we have this investment around for future generations. This field right here is a, is a field of rye grain. It was planted after this corn was taken off for silage with the goals being we need to replace that organic matter that we've taken off in the form of silage. We need to hold this soil from an erosion standpoint and we need to capture any lost nitrogen that may have uh, not been used up by this corn since we had such a dry year. Okay, we've got a, an excellent stand of rye out here. Um, you know, it was planted in September. We had a really dry September. And then in October, November now, we started to cut some rains and it's really thickened up. So we're doing those things, okay? The root structure in rye is very fibrous, it's thick. And that's what's going to give us some, some organic matter. We're going to get more spring growth here when we start to warm up in March and April. That's going to give us some more organic matter. I mean, that's really, really what we're going to capture on here. And we're going to see from a dollars and cents uh, uh, point of view, too, is if we can capture some of that nitrogen that wasn't used. Um, and then as this plant degrades, and that next crop is going to take advantage of, of those nutrients, too, okay? It's very, very windy in South Dakota, as we see right now. Uh, when it was dry, this field would have just been blown if we didn't have any cover on here. Uh, so it's doing a great thing of holding our topsoil in place too, okay? So through practices like this, um, we're holding on to our investment, okay? We're making sure it's around here for, for future years, um, and we're putting money back into our pocket too from having something growing on here. So, great example of what we can do with a, with a rye cover crop on the silage acres. I'm Justin. Thank you very much for watching.